Well, a local teenager has established himself as a top public speaker. Jacoby Kohu Morris is the head boy at Logan Park High School, and he's here to highlight his latest success. Good evening, Jacoby. Kia ora. Uh, so tell us about the competition that uh, you've just recently won. So uh, I've been lucky enough to win the National uh, Lions Young Speechmaker Competition. Um, so that's for people between 17 and 21 around the country. You go through the regionals first and then to the nationals on a topic of your choice. So how many other speakers were you up against in the final? I think it was something about 12. Yeah. Uh, so what was your particular speech about? So I spoke about um, the 100th anniversary of the Gallipoli uh, landings. I think it's significant this year, and not only for young people to, to understand and to commemorate, but for New Zealanders, New Zealanders in general. I spoke about uh, how those who came home brought back with them uh, a sense of leadership, resilience and courage, which I think went on to shape the New Zealand identity, and you see that uh, and how we became an egalitarian uh, society, we became the most equal society on earth. And I made the point that, you know, nowadays we've got 280,000 Kiwi kids living in poverty, uh, growing inequality rates, and these things don't look like they're being solved. And so I made the point that, you know, would our forebears who fought for our nation, what would they think of that? And your speaking success has allowed you to, to travel as well. Yeah, so um, I went over with the uh, New Zealand Defence Force to Gallipoli, uh, to commemorate the 100th anniversary there, so I was there at Anzac Day and it was just uh, the most moving occasion and walking through some of those cemeteries, you know, it uh, really hits home how significant it was to, to us as a country. What other big speeches have you, you given this year, JK? Yeah, so um, that, you know, the travel allowed me uh, to go because I won the regional ANZRSA Cyril Bassett VC speech competition and came second in the, in the national one there, so 25 young people uh, including myself, went over and we all got, you know, uh, we all had a great time and remembered why we were there. How would you say public speaking has, has helped you in other aspects of, of life or your study? Yeah, well I think, um, you know, I was lucky to be elected the head boy of my school and so with that uh, you need to show a lot of leadership and a lot of public speaking involved in that, you know, whether or not that's uh, speaking at assembly or speaking at different events, you know, it's helped me learn how to represent our school and our whānau and community. What makes a good speaker? How have you become a good speaker? Well, I don't um, pretend to be an expert on it, but I think a good speaker is one who can uh, communicate a message and bring the audience with you in, in believing, uh, believing what you're saying and hopefully some of the solutions you bring to the table um, they'll follow through on after the speech competition. So this is your, your final year at, at secondary school at Logan Park. What are your plans at this stage after life after secondary school? Yes, yeah, so um, I'm going to Otago University next year. I'll do a Bachelor of Laws in Commerce. That's sort of the area I'm looking at uh, for now anyway. A dream job in mind? Well, I think hopefully after, after having a career in law or commerce or what have you, I think the big goal is maybe in Parliament one day because I think that's where you can really affect the change that you want to see. If, uh, you look at some of my speeches talking about the inequality, the poverty, I think that Parliament's the perfect platform to voice those views and to enact change. Any more speaking engagements coming up soon? Um, no, that's the last one and so that's why it was really great to finish on that high. Um, you know, working for five years up until that point and, and finally coming away with a national win. Alright, well congratulations on that once again and, and good luck for the, the rest of your final year at Logan Park. Thank you very much. Thanks Jacoby.